All right, guys, welcome back. And welcome to a game called Layers of Fear. You know, I played this game about six years ago. And about 30 minutes or so in, I stopped playing and I never, I never continued it. For some reason, the psychological aspect of this game really got to me. And it was something that me mentally as a person, I just, I just wasn't having it. But I've seen it in the comments. A lot of times, every time we play horror games, I, I see it here and there. And I'm like, you know what? We've played so many more horror games throughout the years now that I might be a little bit better off trying to play a game like this one. It's a really spooky game if you're into the whole psychological, psychedelic horror type of genre, which to me is one of the worst ones because it makes me think I'm crazy. Okay, and it's just a video game, but it makes me think I'm crazy. And I don't like to think I'm crazy. Layers of Fear is a first person psychedelic horror game with a heavy focus on story and exploration. Players take control of a painter whose sole purpose is to finish his magnum opus. Hopefully I pronounced that correctly. The player must navigate through both a consistently changing Victorian era mansion and ghastly visions of the painter's fragile and crumbling psyche. Psyche? 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 I know how you must feel. Lost. Alone. Hopeless. You probably deserve it. But even for you, there is still a way. A way to bring it all back. Alright. That's nice to hear. The one precious thing you ever truly desired. Painting. Finish it. Okay. <laughs> Every portrait that is painted with feeling is a portrait of the artist at the sitter. So I want you guys to do something for me here. I want you to relax, sit down, pause the video, grab a snack, a drink, and just join me, okay? We're gonna take it slow, but just join me. Let's experience this together. Okay, here we go. We are in our house, and I hate games that take place in a big mansion, which is 85% of horror games. Um, <laughs> but that's fine. So. We've got some beautiful paintings here. That's not so beautiful, but it is very artistic indeed. Uh, how do I zoom in? Oh, there it is. That does not look appropriate. The man has killed his wife in front of the kids. How dare he? What is this? Hmm. That looks like a dog uh, mouthpiece or something, huh? Got some kitty shoes. Okay. So hold. Oh, I remember. You got to hold and then like swing the door open. Oh, God. Uh, this is going to suck. Dear sir, we would like to ask you to cease bothering our pest control specialist as we all as well as refrain from sending us any more of your highly inappropriate letters. I'll have you know that my mother is a respectable woman and does not take kindly to such accusations. All of our employees that visited our house reported absolutely no signs of a rodent infestation of any kind. And is uh, and as such decided not to act further than a prophylactic spray. Please treat this letter as a final warning or else the next envelope you receive will be from our lawyers. With best regards... Amber Heard. I'm, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I'm kidding. Carl Denton. Just kidding. I've been watching the Johnny Depp Amber Heard trial for like weeks now. And it's intense. Anyways, on to more uh, important things, I guess. We have a dog. Uh, it seems to be like a collar for a dog or some sort of animal. I don't know if we have a flashlight here. I'm going to go here since this is kind of already opened and we are oh there's wine on the floor the music is freaking awesome by the way figure you'd be up all night so i made you a little treat you know i i bet uh 
even Rembrandt, occasionally took time off from being brilliant and snored his head off like the rest of us common folk. I know. In other words, get some sleep, you big dummy. I love you. Well, I love you too, sweetheart. I don't know who you are, but I love you too. Okay. I better not get a jump scare opening these damn drawers here. Okay. Can I crouch? No. Paint. Rose door. Door. I don't know how to pronounce that. Burnt. Umber. Sienna. Brushes. 25 brushes. 50 packs of air fresheners and... Apples 10 kilogram, booze 30. I hope I'm pronouncing and saying some of these things right. Got one last here. All right, I'll close that back up just in case. No need for this nonsense. Anything else here? I love when games just allow you to open stuff, even when they don't make any sense. Like half of this crap makes no sense. Neither does this really dark pantry room here that I want to turn on the light to because it's kind of creepy. All right, we've got a couple of pallets. Nothing here. As long as the music stays as romantic and beautiful slash peaceful as it is right now, I'm okay with playing this, honestly. I am totally fine and I'm remotely just remotely scared. I'm not that scared. Because I know something's going to happen. I remember some of the things. But not too many. Actually, I don't remember anything. <laughs> I don't. So, an artist triumph. Gallery opening uh, WoW's critics. Some call him the new Caravaggio. Others compare him to Von Eich. And one Austra critic, who wished to remain unnamed, went as far as to invoke the spirit of the great Leonardo. Anyway, you slice it, the exhibition proved an immense success. Distinct style has been praised for its unique uh, unique combination of rena renaissance, influence, and more progressive techniques. The artist himself attended the event in the company of his beautiful fiance, looking stunning in her black gown, revealed to us exclusively that the couple are indeed expecting. Oh, God. Interesting photograph. Why is it so dark, man? I can't see shit. Sir, you didn't touch this workshop or the workshop, just like you asked, although I cannot imagine the mess that's inside. Also, if you care so much for that room, maybe you should pay some more attention to where you leave the keys. I brought them back to your office. It's locked. So, man, I really need a flashlight up in here. Ain't no way I'm fucking going into the basement, man. Oh, here we go. This is where the shit really starts to hit the fan. Turn on the lamp. No, turn on all the lights. Oh! That's me. I'm kind of cute. Yo, I'm dressed real kind of Dressed quite proper, huh? That's right. Turn on all the lights. Achilles prosthetics. Below knee prost prost prosthesis. And how the hell did they fuck up the length? Wait, do I have a prosthetic leg or something? Oh, man. The music is awesome. What is that? Rab poison. All right. Anything else here? Oh, God. Go! Oh, it was a rat traps. Oh, Jesus. Oh, goodness gracious. Okay. Are we going to the basement? 
Ah, we can turn on the light. Now this is more, or much more doable. I do say so. Motherfucking trucker! All right, that was a rat. It was just a rat, no big deal. We're gonna be totally fine. Totally. Can you stop that? Somebody's calling my phone and I'm trying to play a freaking horror game. This is impossible. I have to stay fully engaged. We go. So the report card reading a CDFC. That's terrible grades. Writing terrible grades. Terrible grades. Art and music. <laughs> that's the only thing he's good at. Grade average DDDC. All right. So, so we're out of the basement, and now we're going upstairs. I don't think there was any other room, right? We've got to head to the office, I suppose. To get the keys to the uh, that room down below. There's a couple of rooms that are locked as well, which is kind of interesting. Ah! Fuck! Fuck! <sighs> nah, bro. No. so damn big been working on I don't wake me up is that oh is this my room oh yeah, this is my all around, all this around, all stop 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 it this is definitely my room it says here sorry couldn't sleep the legs been acting up again I figured I uh, might as well do some work I love you okay Interesting. Broken mirror? Galactic's grand opening in flames. Disastrous fire at the new department store. Leaves dozens fighting for their lives. The long awaited opening of the Galactic department store turned into hell on earth when the building's Wiring burst into flames while the majority of his visitors managed to reach the emergency exit in time Several unfortunate attendees were trapped in the back of the building having no chance to escape the raging inferno The exact number of casualties has not been determined uh, Although it is estimated that uh, at least a dozen people have been severely injured the owner of the galactic Ronald uh, Skefiusz Skefjord has uh, so far declined to comment on today's tragic events. Well, how convenient, Mr. Skashfield. Open this up. You know, kind of don't like opening these things. Oh, fuck! Binga! Just freaking called it, man! Goddamn alcoholic! Who uses the damn fucking closet for wine bottles <laughs> oh this is gonna give you a heart attack Bryce <laughs> should have never played this shit but I already spent the twenty dollars I got <laughs> I gotta play it. I'm sorry inflation is too high to be throwing away money like that okay so I think what if that's my office wouldn't 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 the key be somewhere here it's a ring oh wow hold on I mean, if this is my room wouldn't the key be here maybe i should i should search this room a bit more thoroughly 
molasses. Can I read that? Yes. The new face of music. A night at the opera becomes a night into a night to remember. Might not be a household name yet, but just give her time. They are incredibly talented multi-instrumentalist. Given outstanding performance last night, winning over even the most ardent naysayers. She was simply outstanding. I haven't seen such passion, energy, and skill in years, stated famed pianist Daniel Richer. He was not alone in his praise. It seems that even Anthony Giles, one of Arsh's critics, has finally seen the light. Giles had previously made uh, dispar disparaging comments about the artist, stating that there is more to performing music than just enthusiasm and a pretty face. Performance. Uh, when asked if after witnessing last night's performance, he regrets these words. Mr. Giles gave us a look that can only be described as a mixture of awe and embarrassment. Pressed for an answer, he simply said yes. We caught up with the star. Okay. Uh, I think we're, we're done here, right? Yeah, I think we're done here. This is locked. Well, now we're headed into the other side of the house. Into the room that's open and there seems to be... Oh, that's quite interesting. Is this my office? Wait, 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 wait. Don't, don't touch anything. Where is the light here? Can I please turn on the light? There's the light. On... Okay, there's the light. Sorry. Let me just kind of go through these things here. Oh, I love that music, man. That's an interesting painting. Pretty cool. That's the key. Hell yeah. All right, so it says, I'm sorry I'll make it up to you tonight. Uh, it's all about you and me. Let's make it special. You promised. My dear friend, let me ask you one simple question. Have you completely lost your goddamn mind? I know you're going through some rough times right now. I really do. That's why I have agreed to let you do those illustrations in the first place. For old time's sake. I even deliberately gave you a tribal task because I expected Little Red Riding Hood to be something you can draw in your sleep. What I didn't expect is to get this demented nightmare feel, this, uh, nightmare feel you submitted for a, for a kid's bedtime story. There is no way in hell I'm using this and I already regret agreeing to a payment in advance. Please get your shit together. Your old pal, Liam Brickstone, Whispered Tale Publishing House. Yeah, so it seems like maybe with the divorce and stuff, things started. Oh my god. Yeah, that's not. Yeah, my boy. That's. That is not. What in the. Yo, what the fuck? That's hilarious. That reminds me, they're making a Winnie the Pooh horror game. Like, what in the world is that? They're actually making a Winnie the Pooh horror game. Isn't that nuts? Okay, we'll close this up here. See the bottom one. Can I move the chair? Oh god. Alright, so we've got the key. That key's gotta be for that key's gotta be for uh for downstairs. I'm gonna check this area here. What the fuck is that? Are you freaking kidding me right now? Hello? Oh, I'm losing my mind. Oh, this man is losing his mind. Okay, hold on. Where's the light? There's another key there. Or... Oh. Oh, what was that? Oh, no, 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 no. That's a fucking baby. Like, a remember, they were expecting. Oh, 
My God. Oh, shit. Another painting. A lot of broken dolls. Okay, hold on. Just relax. We're here to experience. Stay cool, calm, and collective. No need to panic. This is a drawing. Aw. This reminds me of like the drawings my kids draw me. Got my whole like the back of my door in my office is full of drawings from like Ryan and Ruby that just I love being a dad. Shit kills me when I see stuff like this. Alright, so I think I think we're in the clear. I'm gonna do another lap here just in case I've missed anything. I think we're in the clear. Uh, this door was locked. That key does not work for there. All right, there's two doors that I'm kind of intrigued with. We've got the hallway door. And we've got the door downstairs to the other room that we first encountered. A lot of weird freaking paintings, huh? All right, here we go. The letter said... Yeah, in your office, so should be this one. Voila! We have done it! I did not close that door. I will open this up. That is I. Sexy and handsome as ever. What's this? Oh, wow. Holy smokes. That's crazy. More bottles. Non-alcoholic. Thank the Lord. I will close that up. Start opening this up and see what we what we can find here. A letter. I'm so sick and tired of us talking through these notes. We live in the same house, for God's sake. Come talk to me when you're done. Before you go to sleep. Seems like the guy was so busy painting and all that that he completely forgot to take care of his family that sucks <laughs> a plan with me man lost you deserve it. Finish it. I think something weird happens here. What do you want me to do? What do you want me to finish it? Locked. Damn it. Open up. It's the FBI. Do I have to... Grab the paint, the canvas? No? Get out of here? Alright, what in the fuck? Okay, can I go back? I don't want to come here. Okay, the door's locked. That's fine. Open up. Alright, where's the sweet lullabies that we were listening to in the beginning? Bring him back. Bring him back. Bring him back now. Okay, I don't like this. Let's just settle down. Oh, fuck. Just out of reach. I don't want to go to the window, man. What the fuck? God. I hate games like this. There's no obvious danger, but there's still jump scares, and that's what matters. God, my neck fucking hurts. 
I'm sorry for the foul language, but hey, this is rated R for... I don't know. Binga, my god, my mother. Okay, let's go. We've got this. This is fine. Going in circles. Yes, I am going in circles. That. Ooh. You guys are wild for that. Is that my wife? Scraps of love. Letter. Dear sir and madam. We must kindly, I very strongly, urge you to keep your voices down during the night. Your material problems, your your marital problems, while rege uh, regrettable, are a private matter and should remain that way. They are certainly uh, of no concern to us and especially our children. Please consider that not everyone is a freelance artist. Some of us have to get up early and work for a living. We need our sleep. We must also warn you that if things continue the way that they are now, we will be forced to call the police. Let's see all your neighbors. You know what I say? Screw them neighbors. I don't see any neighbors nearby. This house is huge. If you if what house is built like this? With neighbors. I mean, yeah, neighbors, but they're like, you know. Probably 70 yards apart. Those are just trees. No need to get scared. I will open up the closet very, very carefully. Good. I was about to ask, where's... Where is the light in this room? 8-5... Eight five four. Okay. Yeah, good. Easy. The pass holds back. Look closer. The thought alone that the most beautiful piece of art doesn't have my name on it is killing me. So, will you marry me? Wow, that's deep. Hey, I'm gonna use that on Rebecca. That's deep. <laughs> Pretty good line, bro. And now there's a door here. Phenomenal. Sensational. I'm trying to keep, keep it playful here so we don't get spooked, you know. That chair is totally rocking by itself. No, stop that. Why? Like, wh why, 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 why must we take it to these extremes? Stop. Please. You've been snooping around my workshop again. For the last time, you are not allowed in that room. Even if the door happens to be open, I forbid. I forbid it. This is your last warning. Next time you'll have to look for a new job. Okay. It's kind of cruel. Oh, uh, what was that? Fuck. All right. Everything's fine. Everything is okay. What is that over there? Oh God. It's an upside down doll on a painting. Okay, we've got a world globe there. All right, is there a light here, please? Fuck, I need light. Don't want to interact with that dog just yet. Hold on. Okay, here goes nothing. Ah! Ah! Mike. <sighs> what? 
Where am I? I'm dizzy as f What is this, man? Oh, I can't see it. Dust mice, even in my lungs. Grotesque vermin dirt. There is always more. For what time is it? Oh my god, it's only 12.47. I thought it was like later than that. Ooh, good. Voila. Let there be light. Okay, so we've- Oh my god! You don't scare me, bucko. I've played crazy horror games over the last six years. My love, even though you have not been born yet, I can already feel your presence. It's simply amazing. I just cannot believe how lucky I am. A year ago, all I had was talent and ambition. Now, against all odds, I have a career, a loving husband, and you. I have never been a deeply religious person, I guess. Uh, no. I guess what other people uh, look for in a sermon um, I found in perfecting my arts. But now I can help. I cannot help but feel like there is a higher power watching over me. The one, the once told me that uh, they once told me that I would never succeed as a musician. Now I'm playing sold-out concerts at some of the most prestigious venues in the country. They also said I had difficult, I had a difficult character, and that I would never find a soulmate. Guess again. Finally, a doctor once told me that I would never be able to have children on my own, and yet here you are. Within me, I'm quite possibly the happiest woman in the world. I love you so. Oh, that's cute. That's cute. Okay, I can respect that. All right, so let me go back here. Nothing here, right? Just making sure. All right, let's get out of here. Oh, God. All right, I'm going to pull the mysterious lever. Lever. Oh, that was the door that was in our office. Or this office. A secret passageway. What? See, I'm telling you, this game makes you feel like you're crazy. Some dominoes. Love dominoes. Pretty sure I didn't close that. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, these drawings are fucked. I'm out of here. Oh, I'm out of here. Paint deep lies. Paint deep lies. What is this? Talk to me now, dirty. A tiny bit to the left. Yes, just like that. Yes, like Hold that, that pose. That. I want to get all those lovely curves just right. Just right. <laughs> So I kind of like interact with individual paintings. Just making sure that's not something I'm missing. All right, so we have another room here. Quite interesting. More rats. You said there was no rat rat infestation. Uh, sorry to break it to you, but uh, you were quite wrong. There is a lot of rats. like the fifth where are they coming from what the hell okay can we come down with the rats oh hi okay bring back the rats bring back the rats bring them back I 
I'm going crazy. This guy is going crazy. Oh, how many rooms does this place have? How do you have neighbors that can hear you when you have this big a house? It makes no sense. I mean, unless these guys were arguing with fucking, I don't know, megaphones or something, then okay. Oh, no, 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 no. Let's not go there. Okay, we're not, we're not going there. Sweetheart. Don't cry. Hello. It's about time for us to talk, don't you think? I mean, I've seen you in my house so many times. And yet I could never find the courage to face you directly. Not until now. I'll be right back. Just calm it down. <laughs> Stop the crying. It'll be all right. Okay, I'm gonna stop. I'm gonna stop. Just calm down. I, I just don't know when to expect a jump scare. This game, it started off so nice and calm. And it just gets more and more intense. And for the love of God, give me some light here. <clears throat> Seems like some sort of winery area here. A lot of, a lot of these things I can't see very much because I have a light in front of my face, so it's hard to see the screen. Oh shit! Wet floors. Okay. See what's happening here? Oh. Wait. We're back in the kitchen. Yo, what the hell is so trippy? Okay, hold on. Something's gonna give here. Got a scale. Oh, hi. Hello? Door's locked. Is it time for us to start opening these 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 drawers here? Maybe, possibly. What do we have to put in the scale? On the scale! Oh hi! Alright, alright, what's up? What's up? What is up? some of the potatoes first I looked for a canvas not just any canvas I had to find a knife not one of those bread ones it needed to be as sharp as a razor so I used a razor in fact and then carefully flayed the skin booze helped keep my hand steady no oh, what are you talking about dude relax calm it down who's there Okay, can I leave? Oh, fuck. Open this up again. Okay, this is the only door available right now. So, we're back in the painting room. This is where shit started to get kind of crazy, so... Just keep in mind, expect the unexpected. Oh. Are these kind of like where we place all the collectibles? Yes, it seems like our journal, yeah. Ah, oh, okay. So this is kind of like a little debriefing area, if you will. Oh, we're going to put the... Are we putting the skin there? 
Oh, wow. What is that? That's not very, uh... <laughs> What the fuck is that? Okay. First I looked for a canvas. Not just any canvas. I had to find a knife. Okay, what he said. It's just written there. Oh, wow. So I gotta place all of these. Oh my god. We've got one, two, three, four, five more. Wow. Five more cabinets to fill with pieces of skin all right sleepless dreams all right open up let's go there is no time for the weak we shall persevere forward and keep on marching forward we've got this apparently we've, we've got multiple floors in this house as well gotta close the gate Oh, I didn't close it all the way. <laughs> Jesus. Yeah, multiple doors. That one's locked. Alright, we've got a vase. We've got two doors here. Locked and locked. Let me guess. Fantastic. Super predictable. One just opened behind me. Okay, now the game's fucking with me. What is that? Oh. Hi. Whatever you do, please do not close the door. This room is excessively claustrophobic. <sighs> Dear sir, while I can certainly understand that you are upset and I have nothing but sympathy for your wife and yourself, I must categor categorically state <laughs> that I do not wish to receive any further correspondence from you in this matter. Any skin graft procedure is extremely complicated and inherently associated with the risk of failure having stated that i assure you that me and my colleagues at saint anne have made every effort to ensure a positive a positive outcome for your wife personally speaking i believe we have done the best job possible considering the extent of tissue damage you are of course entitled to your own opinion and i can certainly understand your disappointments what i do not understand is how you seem to think writing hateful letters to me or my fellow doctors will ameliorate, uh, ameliorate the situation. As I've already stated, I can, I, I can certainly understand you've been under a lot of stress as of late, and thus I will not stress charges, uh, press charges if you refrain, refrain from any further correspondence. Let me make it absolutely clear that I will not tolerate any further threats aimed at my staff, my family, or myself. If you wish to seek psychological help, I can have my assistant provide contact information for several specialists who would be more than competent to help you get through these hard times. With regards and best wishes for you and your wife, William H. Green, MD. Asshole. Oh, the piano's playing. This should be open, right? Yeah, it's open. Memories of my beautiful wife playing the piano. Why did you stop? That tune was perfect. Honey, please, just a little longer. At least until I finish painting this one part. Oh, don't make me beg. Okay. Honey? Alright, wait. There's another, the, the last door, right? No. Oh, God. Oh, here we go, here we go. 
Oh, we're in business now. Open up, damn it. Oh, shit. Hold on. All right. I'm going up. Up to the attic. Nothing good ever happens in the attic. And most definitely not a burning attic. All right. This house is massive, bro. What in the world? I've always wished I had an attic so I can place my office in an attic. I, I, I've always loved to do that. Fortunately, my attic is not one of those like attics you see up north where you can literally have a room in there. Oh shit! And I think this guy's wife started dying or she had some sort of issue. He started going crazy. I don't know. We'll see. Make your mind. Get more rats. That's great. Warning signs. The following list is a, comp a compilation of the most common symptoms of schizophrenia. While typically diagnosed between the ages of 15 and 25, the disorder is known to affect older patients as well. Note that these symptoms are not exclusively exclusive to schizophrenia and should be and should by no means be treated as conclusive evidence of this particular affliction. In order to obtain a proper diagnosis, you should contact a qualified specialist. Blank expressions, stares off into space, yes, and voluntary facial movements, yes. Insomnia, haven't noticed. Uh, unusual gestures of postures, always had that. Unable to experience joy from activities, definitely. Uh, depersonalization, what does that even mean? Awkward, clumsy movements, might be from the accidents. Prone to anger. Res resentment, uh, more passive aggressive, lack of motivation, yes, suicidal tendencies. Okay, hold on. We have another room here that we've got to go to. God, I don't even want to move a fucking muscle. We came from over there, right? Okay. Oh, this is that room again. Oh, no, it's not. This is a different room. Yoo-hoo! Just passing on by. No need to do anything supernatural. Just stay natural. Okay, nothing crazy. Nothing supernatural. Just stay natural. Damn it. Hello? What in the actual heck is that? All right, there's like bugs in there. I'm not going in there. Bro, I can't see anything. I'm so nervous. All right, so we have here a door. <laughs> a door. I'm going to spin the world globe. Oh. We have some writing on the wall. It's kind of interesting. Oh, hi. Don't do that. Let's get that 
be undone. Cannot be undone. I cannot be undone. It cannot be undone. Yo, this is a game. It just keeps on throwing you into different rooms and different experiences. It is freaking nuts. All right, back in the hallway of death. Oh, not a dog. Come on, don't kill the dog. Don't. That's a pretty painting. That is a beautiful painting. Oh, this man is fucked in the head. 100%. You grab that top drawer, man. Good boy. Yikes. Make sure there's nothing here missing. Let me go to that little little table over here you never know this game has a lot of areas where where you can find certain clues and although they don't really pertain to you finishing the game or not but they add to the story so I don't want to go too crazy although I kind of want to speed run this shit but on the other side I don't have the balls to you want this as veil as as well I can't even read, apparently. Apparently, I can't read. Okay, hi. That didn't scare me. Oh, Pio! What did I just... Oh, what? What? Bro, what did I just say? What the... F <laughs> what the... F I don't even know what word came out of my mouth, bro. Oh, my God. Bro. I have no idea. I'm all right. Involuntary speaking apparently is a new trait of me when I get scared. I don't know. I feel like I'm being watched every step of the way. And it's pissing me off. God. Excuse me, I burped. I'm going left. Screw it. Oh, God. That was a bad idea. I should have gone right. Oh, goodness. Hello? Is there a light? There's a light. There's a light right there. Turn, turn it on. I can't see anything on the wall, so it's too dark for me. Oh, there, there's light. A little lamp there. Very nice. September 12th. She's been at it again earlier in the day. I found more of her reviews. A little note stuck to the. To one of my latest paintings. Some of the most sketching, hateful shit I've ever read about my work. I guess I shouldn't be surprised. After all, she knows me well enough to know what really gets to me. I just cannot believe she would use that against me. Worst thing is, when I confronted her about it, she claimed that she hadn't written any of them. Like, I can't tell her handwriting. Jesus. Does she really hate me that much? Or is her mind starting to slip? I just don't know what to do anymore. Definitely, whoa, fuck me, hi. Definitely don't do that.
Okay. Everything's okay. Too many sounds. Too many hallways. Too many doors. Too much confusion. Too much bullshit. Why? Turn on them freaking candles, bro. I've had enough of this crap. What is that? Stop! 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 Turning off the fucking candles! That's me and my wife. Inspired OCD. Yeah, that's uh, an OCD inducing nightmare. What do you want, damn it? Is that Satan? Open up then. Show yourself. Fuck. He's playing with me, bro. He's playing with me. Do something. I have a key. What do you mean? Oh, now you want to open up the door. Well, this is not blood. Just painting. Nice. All right, hold on. What's going on here? Oh, hi. That's my cane. This house is absolutely amazing. amazing. Oh, but those stairs. With that leg of mine, I think you'll have to carry me to the bedroom once we move in. Wow, so business was so good that they freaking bought the house. The careers took off, it seems like. That's cool. Good for them. Little did they know. <laughs> this place was fucked. Okay, wait a minute. I've been, yeah, I've been in this room before. Prosthetic snatchers. Why the damn leg? Inst uh, insatiable bastards can't afford a new one. Why the damn leg? Wonder if he ever started going broke due to his issues not being able to perform or paint or Let me open this up. Honey, what in the world are you doing? What did the doctor say about straining yourself? Leave that thing alone. It's not going anywhere. I think I gotta get this record and play it. Yeah. <clears throat> and hit play, possibly. do its thing we'll sit back and just kind of relax here <laughs> are we done is it over Stop. 
stop it, stop. I needed a jar and a plastic tubing. I siphoned gas before. I knew how it was done. I stuck the tube in a vein and sucked on it until blood filled my mouth. Then put the tube in the jar and it just kept coming. The taste of copper haunted me the entire night. Why didn't I think of a syringe? Hmm. Oh, okay, so now I can probably put it back. Yes. Alright, so it's not so much about the tempo or speed, more than just like backwards. Yes, I see. Now everything goes back. Alright, so I should be able to leave now. Aha! Uh -huh. Perfect. And we're back here at the painting room. Some more collectibles. Oh, stop looking at me like that. It's just a little something to help me focus on my work. That's all. Liquid courage. Here's the blood. Here's the piece of skin. What are the other four parts? It's fucking wild, bro. Hate even now, lost alone. You deserve it. I. Gra I gave grave a grave for you. Finish it. Back in the main hall here. Seems like. Open up these cabinets just in case there's any other stuff we can find here. Who's that? This game is so confusing, like as far as like all the rooms, how they change on you. It's insane. That's a piano with <laughs> I just, I can't, I, I can't deal with this, man. This is constant bullshit. Turn on the freaking. But there's no door. Wasn't there a door behind me? Can't see anything. Bro, I can't see anything. Oh, it's locked. No, oh, what the hell was that? Oh! oh my God. Okay. Don't know. No. Okay. Inside an empty room. What could possibly go wrong? Of course, that, that, <laughs> I don't, I don't want to turn around. Of course, it's, it's always an illusion. Always. What is this? Why am I? Hello? Let's just please come. Okay, can I get out of here? Don't tell me I have to go up to the freaking doll. Oh, look at the sh look at the shadow though. Yoo-hoo. Thanks for the key, bud. Appreciate ya. Now get the hell out of here with you and your demons. Nobody wants you around here. Open up, damn it!
Come on. Giddy up now. Let's just, let's just get out of here. Turn on the lamp, of course. I'm not a friend of darkness. I don't intend to be. September 15th. More notes today. Even worse than before. The sad part is... I agree with every word. Are we back in the hallway? I think that key, we're going to use it to uh, open up one of these doors here. Possibly. That's not a door. That is a closet. And I think I just used the key. Oh. Cretans. Blind fools. Ignorance. Ingrates. Portrait. So that's where I painted you fucking plant. Maybe I need to kick some artistic sense into your stupid face. Bro, I'm scared to look around because I know this this game just changes on you. In the blink of an eye. This... Okay, so... Where do I go now? Can we turn on this lamp, please? For the love of God. Thank you. Very appreciated. Yeah, we haven't been up here before. Oh, certainly. <laughs> certainly not, not down there. That's locked, so guess what? We're going down there. Let's go. Giddy up. One step at a time. No need to get scared. Well, we've already gotten further than what we ever got. <coughs> oh, shit. Excuse me. In the first time. The first time I played this. Yoo-hoo! Now, who's doing that? I don't know whether to... Distinguish that noise with a telephone or All right, ho hold on a sec Dear sir If I am to be honest, I cannot stand your letter uh, I can't say your letter was unexpected numerous colleagues have informed me that you had previously sought their advice in this matter and while it is perfectly understandable for a patient to demand a second opinion, I would think 16 concurring opinions would be enough. Still, out of respect for you and your wife, I have examined the case thoroughly and I have and I have to concur with my colleagues. Uh, involuntary muscle pa uh, spasms are not uncommon with patients who have suffered burns as severe as your wife did. Oh shit. What you refer to as a freakish grin or an un... Uh, unnerving yelp though many would find such expressions hurtful could indeed be manifestation of nerve damage the other symptoms you mentioned do not seem to be psychological but rather purely psychological in nature traumatic events can lead to severe stress and that is nothing to be ashamed of as up to your demand that we fix your wife you have to understand that what she went through cannot be undone with one simple procedure it is as it is a long, arduous process that will require all of your strength and support. Please feel free to contact me or my colleagues should you wish to discuss a long-term rehabilitation program. Dr. Richards, another fucking quack. Will you stop it? I'm trying to read a damn letter. God, that is so annoying. It is a phone. I knew it. And now we're going to keep going in circles here because that's just that's just what this game does. Okay. We're going in circles here. I'm going to open up the door. Another letter. Same letter. Hey. 
Answer the phone. Can I pick up the phone? No? What is this, man? Aha! Uh -huh. <laughs> gotcha, bitch! Yes, speaker. Oh god, this is so annoying. Oh god! Hello? Yes, speak. Yes, speak. Yes, speak. What? Oh, wow. What fire? fire? Oh god. Is she... she... Which hospital? Which hospital? I I'm on my way. Notice there's like a little limp to him, huh? See the limp on the run? There's a little limp to it. It's kind of interesting. All right, so we're on the way to the hospital. Restless memories. Man, this story is getting really interesting. Say they're red thoughts? What? Oh, I can't, can't distinguish. Oh no. <laughs> what? Got a lot of books. You guys like books? Dude, I don't even know. Let me check this out. Flapping horror. Be quiet. Constantly flapping, eating other rats. Oh, here's the hallway again. Oh, hi. No. This is not this is not what I signed up for. going crazy. It's only a game. We can walk through this. This is just a game. It's fine. It's just a game. We can do this. I love how he has the lamp. Like it's, it makes it feel real. You know, hope is the mind killer. Is it now? Oh, we're going somewhere else now. And <laughs> we're going left. Oh, yeah. Buckle up, partner. We're going down. Alright. Open up. Got a chest right here, right off the bat. In any case, as your lawyer, I advise you to refrain from an imp prudent act any imprudent actions in other words do not do anything stupid we still have a chance of winning this believe it or not uh, i've gotten clients out of deeper shit than this just don't make it any worse lay low for a while and let me appeal the court order this social uh, social worker definitely has it in for you we can use that to our advantage portraying you as a victim of the system a husband in mourning a, mo a momentary lapse of reason an overzealous uh, bureaucrat. Trust me, this is our best uh, option considering uh, what you've been through lately. I'd say we have a good 50 50 chance of a good outcome, but 
Not if you keep trying to convince everyone that you've gone completely insane. No more outbursts. No more rambling. Better yet, no public appearances whatsoever. You can still get your dog. My daughter's. Oh, I thought my daughter had died too. She's alive. Seems like that's good. At least the daughter's alive. Oh, yeah. I don't like this. Okay, we've got a door right there. It's good. We're not going crazy just yet. Fine, tight hallways. Everybody loves tight hallways. <laughs> Predictable. Predictable. It's it's coming. It's coming. Get ready for it. It's coming. Turning on the candles. Another door. How about the water? No. Oh, there's water. Oh no, that's blood. Or is it wine? Who knows? Or who cares? I don't care. Thankfully, there's nobody in there. That could have been a good place to put a jump scare. You, you, you guys got to do better than that. Come on now. Come on. You got you got to do better than that. Okay. A bathroom. Full of either. Oh no! Don't do that. Don't do that. Silent floaters. They clog the drains. Front of the water. No baths for me. Yeah, let's let's not let's let's not do that. Disgustingness. All right, the pallet has been removed, and we are on our way. Okay, we've got multiple doors here. We've got the light. Let there be light. Always let there be light. Got a candle. Is there anybody in here? Is it really just me, myself, and my thoughts? I am going crazy. And I do not like it. Ah, finally, we have found a door with... Which leads to a room with four more doors. And they are most likely... One is blocked. Two is blocked. And three is blocked. How, how did I know that? And the fourth one we came from is open. Which leads us to another fucking hallway. I can't see shit. Honestly. Oh god. I can't see anything. No. Oh. Okay, we're back in the basement. What is that? Hello? Oh, that's a clock. I thought that was somebody holding their hands up. Uh oh, it's coming. What's happening? Thirsty furry leeches, afraid to look up. This game is such a mindfuck. Like, it really, really is. I cannot even describe how mentally drained I am right now. Can I, can I leave? Is that possible? Can I just please be excused from this nonsense? Let me go back into the clock room with the piano here. Oh, 
hi. I had to play the piano. I had to... All right, fine. I had no idea. Shit. Wish I would have known sooner. Oh, this is great. So the piano is what I needed to remove the debris. In a sense. Okay. Let me see. Can I walk this way and... Beautiful music and all. Really appreciate it, but... What are we doing exactly? All right, seriously, what's going on here? Oh, hi. Am I in timeout? Hello? Bro, I can't see shit. It's crazy. The, the hop in his step is getting heavier and heavier, more intense as we progress through the story. It's kind of nuts to see. Now look at this room. It's going to shambles. Interesting. That's the third one, right? The bone. The flesh, blood, bone. Wonder what else is next. Hmm. All right. So, tell you what, guys. We're going to end it here. Um, I think we're about halfway through the game. If I'm being completely honest, um, we'll see how the video does. If you guys would like to see the rest of the game, I think if we were to do one more episode, we would probably finish it off there. So if, if this video does well, then we'll do the last and final episode and get to the finish line, the ending of this game, and see how this story unravels and, and what really happened here. You know, it, obviously a lot more info is coming, is coming to light and uh, it, it's getting really interesting. But uh, yeah, you guys be the judge. Let me know in the comments. Drop the video a like if you would like to see the last and final part. And thank you for joining me today. Uh, I guess it's been a pleasure. But uh, yeah, thanks for watching. Catch you later.